Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Sambu from Cloud Tech. Today we are going to demonstrate like if you would like to remove multi-factor authentication for a root user, then how we can remove that. So that particular part today we are going to demonstrate. Okay guys. So if you guys are new to my channel, then I would like to request you guys, please subscribe my channel so that I will get more motivation on that to create this kind of video. Okay guys. So let's move on to the demo. So let's log into the AWS console. So I will log in as a root user here. Let us log in here. Since I have already enabled multi-factor authentication, so it will ask me to give that MFA code. So let's give that MFA code. Once I put that MFA code, now I am in the AWS console. Okay, guys. So now, since it is a root user, right? If you go to the IAM, I can't see that particular user in that IAM user section since it is a root user. But I can see here it is a enable that MFA, right? But if you go to the root user section, here it is a zero, no user actually present. Then how I can remove? In generally, if you go to that uh, Google search, how to remove? If you search here, how to remove MFA? It will give you that like uh, go to the IAM console, choose user in the navigation panel, the name and then remove the MFA, right? Since it is a root user, there is no option to choose the user right here from that user section. Then how I can remove? That's the challenging thing, right? So what I can do here is let's go to the right side corner where that your name is showing, right? So if you click here, here we have an option like credential, right? If you click on the credential, let's go to there and then we can see here the multi-factor authentication option is available here. Now from here, this is the virtual, right? This is the multi-factor authentication. This all we can remove from here. Then how we can remove? Let's remove like this. Once you remove, right? So it has got removed. Now what we can check now? Let's go to the dashboard and just click on refresh. Now we can see it is successfully removed, right? Now try to log in again just to make sure. Go to the root user, log in again. Now it is not asking the MFA, right? It's got removed. So this is how we can remove that MFA for a particular root user. Okay, guys. So I hope this video will helpful to you guys. And if you feel this video is valuable, then I will request you guys. Please like this video and subscribe my channel and share surrounding with your friend. I will see you guys in my next video. Shalom. Bye.